Okay, okay. Hear me out. Is Typhon run by the Illuminati? That would explain the conspicuously triangle-shaped logo. Boom! Finally cracked it. <laughs> hey. Alex. So, how did things go with Charlotte? It was intense, but I think maybe she'll be okay. Honestly, I'm not sure how to even talk about it. That's okay. You don't have to. So please tell me that the USB stick revealed all of Typhon's secrets. Not yet, but Alex. We found a recording of Gabe's call. I should probably listen to that. I need to know. We're here for you, okay? Typhon safety. Mac? It's me. I'm working, Gabe. We can talk about what happened later. This isn't about that. I need you to call off the explosion. Ethan's in the blast radius. Shit. He could get killed. What the hell's wrong with you? He snuck off. We're, we're up here right now, trying to find him. Mac, please. All right. I'm on it. We'll hold the blasts. Fuck. You can't imagine the headaches this will create for me. Thanks, Smack. Whatever. Just doing my job. They just ignored him. <laughs> it's so fucked. You know it's bad when Mac turns out to be the good guy. Yep. Alex. You okay? We're gonna get him. I promise. What the hell? Oh, it doesn't matter. None of it fucking matters. He's dead. Oh, He's... because I, I took her anger. Right, 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 right. So there are. What that actually did not work out in the end. I don't need to take this. <laughs> I'm sorry. I should follow her. We'll be right downstairs, all right? is taking these fuckers down. This USB stick has what I need. Time to dig through it. Brian brought this down from his station. Hope it comes in handy. A cold case and a warm beer. If that happened to me, what's happening to Charlotte? A key part of any good investigation. Thanks for spilling your guts. Gabe's call came in from the sat phone at 8.41 p.m. I should find the next call and see if that has any information. Lena, it's Diane. We have a problem. You're kidding. There's a kid lost in the mountains near the pit. We need to postpone. Lena? Haven is your site, Diane, and therefore this is your decision. I know I don't need to remind you of the stakes. Someone could be hurt. Or killed. We've been over this. Anyone up there has disregarded posted notices and accepted full liability. We're talking about a child. I'm just asking for one day. If you postpone tonight's scheduled blast, you put Rhea in jeopardy. That puts the whole company in jeopardy. Is that what you want? No. 
then do the math and make the right call. Email me when it's done. I will. So Typhon thought Rhea, whatever that is, was worth risking our lives. Let's hope Diane's email sheds more light. Seems like a lot is hanging on these inspections. Okay, so this call was... This is the email Diane mentioned. So what is Rhea? Damn. Is this what Diane sold her soul for? Too bad money can't fix all of Typhon's problems. Who would have thought getting away with murder would be so... bureaucratic? This is ACSD. How can we feed you? Is the good picking chicken thing still going on? It sure is. Nice. Uh, let me get a large order of the spicy nuggets. Excellent choice. And would you like the biscuit and gravy or the mashed potatoes and gravy? Oof. Uh... Okay. I, uh... Sir? Oh, fuck. Um, sorry. Do you, do you need a minute? No. No, no. I'm, uh, gonna go with the bis... Uh, potatoes. Yeah, let's just do potatoes. You could do both for 50 cents extra. Oh, my God. You still there? Yeah. No, um... Uh, no, that's okay. Just the potatoes. Okay. I've got you down for a large order of spicy nuggets with potatoes. That'll be ready for you to pick up in about 30 minutes. Thanks. That was riveting. Lace Flowers, this is Riley. How can I help you? Hey, Bev, it's me. Mac, hey, what's up? I'm on lunch. Oh, you're not going to believe what J-Man did this morning with some of the new diet. Hey, so I'm not sure about this part here. It's Mac. Is that Gabe? Hey, Mac, can we talk later? I'm kind of busy. Busy how? Let's hang out when you get off, okay? Hold up, why is Gabe there? Okay, talk soon. I love you. Wait, Riley. Oh, Mac. Typhon Mining, this is Diane. Hi, Diane. It's Rose, down at Town Hall. Hey, Rose, how are you? Oh, I'm busy as a bee this time of year. You have a second? Some folks have come in here with some qu- Typhon Mining. Diane? Oh, hey, Joe. How are you? I'm good. Doing real good. So I have a pretty good list of candidates to go over with you. Looks like I've got 40 names. Great work. When can we go over it? Uh, Typhon Mike? HMB Investigations. Bennett speaking. Hi, Bennett. This is Diane Jacobs. Lena told me. Yep. Been expecting your call. Okay. I'm not sure what the next step is. Just need all the pertinent information on the employee in question. Name, number, address, significant others. We'll handle the rest. I see. Just come by the office. My secretary will take everything down. No records that you were even there. Got it. Okay. I'll come by tomorrow. Looking forward to it. It's so gross that Typhon has people watched. Typhon Mining, this is Diane. Hello, Diane. My name is Rory Praha. I'm a journalist with the Rocky Mountain Gazette. We'll be printing a story on last night's accident in the paper tomorrow. Would you like to provide a comment? Yes, I would. Last night's accident was tragic, and made all the more unfortunate by the fact that it could have been avoided with a simple phone call. A simple phone call? Can you speak more about that? Of course. Typhon always has a safety manager on duty. One quick call from Mr. Chen to our 24-hour emergency line would have alerted us that there were people in the danger zone, and we could have reacted accordingly and stopped the blasts. Are other Haven citizens in danger of meeting the same fate as Gabe Chen? Absolutely not. As long as you heed the warning signs, you will be safe. And if you ever do find yourself in an emergency, that's what our emergency line is for. There's no danger whatsoever. All right. We'll be sure to include your comments. Thanks for giving me your time, Diane. Have a nice day. Typhon Mining, this is Brandon. Hello. I'm calling from the Department of Land and Resources to confirm the inspection set for next week. Yeah, let me grab Diane for you. Thanks. This is Diane. Hi, Diane. I'm calling to... Confirm inspections? <laughs> yes. Did you have a chance to look over the email I sent? I did. Everything looks great. Glad to hear it. I'll see you Thursday then. Mm-hmm. Have a good one. You too. There must be a lot riding on these inspections. Typhon Mining, this is Diane. Hi, Diane. It's Rose.
Who would have thought getting away with murder would be too bad money can't f damn. This is the email seems like a lot. This is the email Diane mentioned. So what is Rhea? Typhon Mining, this is Brandon. Hello, I'm calling from the department. Typhon Mining, this is Diane. Hi, Diane. It's Rose, down at Town Hall. Hey, Rose, how are you? Oh, I'm busy as a bee this time of year. You have a second? Some folks have come in here with some questions about the expansion and all that. I was hoping you could give me some answers to pass along to them. I'll do my best. What are the questions? Let's see here. Okay, first question. How many jobs do you expect to create by opening a second pit? We'll be starting with 25 new positions, but that number is expected to grow to 45 within the first year. Oh, give me just a moment here to jot that down. Alrighty, next up. A uh, number of questions regarding risks for pollution. Water, air quality, etc., etc. Anything you can offer there? You know, let me pass that on to our environmental outreach department. They'll get back to you with all the relevant fact and figures. Oh, sure, sure. No problem at all. And last one. They want to know if there will be more mining vehicles driving through town. Yes, we will be increasing our transportation needs somewhat with the expansion. But to minimize disturbance, we plan to direct drivers to stick to approved trucking routes. And of course, never after 6 o'clock. Never after 6. Thanks so much, Diane. That's all I have for you right now. My pleasure. Have a good one, Rose. You too. Hi, Belts Plumbing. How can I help you? Hi, I'm, uh, I'm of Typhon Mining. I think we had one of your plumbers up here last week. Typhon Mining. Uh, give me just one second to check our records. Yes, I have a record of a service call regarding some sewage backup. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah, so, um, I don't think it's fixed. The field report I have says that the issue was diagnosed and solved. Can you describe what you're seeing? Oh, uh, it, you know, I, I really can't. Look, can you just send someone? I'll have someone out to you later this afternoon. Great. Have a nice day. Yeah, I doubt it. Yeah. Typhon Mining. Diane? Oh, hey, Joe. How are you? I'm good. Doing real good. So I have a pretty good list of candidates to go over with you. Looks like I've got 40 names. Great work. When can we go over it? Uh, hey, Diane? Can I be candid for a moment? Please. It's just... Well, we've all been following the news and... I don't know. After that accident... Joe? I just want to be sure there really are positions waiting for these people. There's nothing to worry about. If you have qualified candidates to show me, I have jobs to offer them. Glad to hear it. You free Tuesday afternoon? Around three? Sure. Great. Looking forward to it. Me too. See you later, Joe. Seems whatever Typhon was up to, it looks like they've all but gotten away with it. Of course that was Diane's idea. I'm gonna make sure this expansion fails if it's the last thing I do. This is the email Diane mentioned. Rhea went off undetected. A second blast went off that night? What did Lena say? Without the scheduled blast, Rhea will be discovered. It was a diversion. They set off the blast that killed Gabe to cover up another one somewhere else. That's why they couldn't wait. I can find out where that blast went off. It might tell me why it was so important. Damn, what a polite way of saying to Ben. Wait, who would have the timing of all this? And I thought the timing, and I thought the timing of all seems like, of course, I'm gonna make a sec. He had an Rhea, you're good. I bet this is, wow. That's a funny way to spell criminal negligence, damn. What a polite way of saying situation. You mean that guy you killed? Too bad. Wait. Does this mean someone at Typhon feels actual human emotion? No. He's talking about it like it's a sure thing. Typhon Mining. Diane? Oh. Typhon Mining, this is Diane. Hello, Diane. My name is Rory Praha. I'm a journalist with the Rocky Mountain Gazette. We'll be printing a story. Lena. Hello, Diane. Is it safe to assume you've gotten your emotions under control? My emotions? Someone was killed last night because of a decision you made. I think- I would be very careful with what you say next. Who do you think is more at risk here? Me or you? Excuse me? 
Now, of course, we're all committed to helping you make it through this difficult period. Lena, it's Diane. We have a problem. You're kidding. There's a kid lost in the mountains near the pit. We need to postpone. Lena? Haven is your site, Diane, and therefore this is your decision. I know I don't need to remind you of the stakes. Someone could be hurt. Or killed. We've been over this. Anyone up there has disregarded posted notices and accepted full liability. We're talking about a child. I'm just asking for one day. If you postpone tonight's scheduled blast, you put Rhea in jeopardy. That puts the whole company in jeopardy. Is that what you want? No. Then do the math and make the right call. Email me when it's done. I will. Lena. Hello, Diane. Is it safe to assume you've gotten your emotions under control? My emotions? Someone was killed last night because of a decision you made. I think... I would be very careful with what you say next. Who do you think is more at risk here? Me or you? Excuse me? Diane has dossiers on the entire Haven Council. That's not creepy at all. Typhon knows about Eleanor's dementia. Shit. It won't be so secure once we tell Jed what really happened that night. I knew that affidavit gave me a bad feeling. Poor Ducky. I didn't know. What? Pike has a... Okay. Bigger fish to fry right now. Typhon knows about Ellen. This is Rhea. Fuck. This map's too small to tell where this is. I need a map. That's the site of the 2008 Typhon mine collapse. Why would they set off a blast in their current mine to cover up a blast in their old mine? Didn't Typhon just have inspections around the old site? They weren't mining for anything. They were burying something. Pike, it's all on this USB drive. All the evidence you need to nail Typhon for Gabe's death and plenty more. All right. Bring it with you. I'll meet you in an hour. Thanks. Talk soon. Citizens of Haven Springs, we are live at the Spring Festival. One final reminder to head over to the Lathe flower cart and grab a rose before they're gone. At Haven's inaugural Spring Festival, eligible women of good stock and birthing age would offer up roses in order to attract a mate. What can I say? History is weird. Thankfully, we've lost the mating stuff, but kept the roses. And if you do have a special someone in mind, a rose is a great way to say you care, and an even better way to say, hey look, a rose.
Sounds fun. Is giving away a rose something I'd do? Maybe. I can decide downstairs. For now, I'll grab the USB stick. Yeah, I want to change first. Stick with Minesweeper from now on. You know, where did I put the USB? Traditionally, you give roses to your crush at the Spring Festival, so... I've never had a girl give me flowers before. I'm sorry. I didn't know you cared so much about traditional gender roles. I'll get back to my butter churning and doilies. Shut up. You first. Will you be my date to the festival, Shu Shu? Found it. Okay, time to head downstairs. Fest. Thanks. I need to apologize to you guys. What happened in the apartment? Something really messed me up. Hearing Gabe's voice, I wasn't ready for that. I thought I was, but. It's the same old story. I lose control, and I hurt the people I care about. I'm sorry. Yeah. Fuck that. If anyone needs to apologize, it's me. Ever since we've met, you've been there for me. And then when you're the one struggling, I bail. Not cool. I'm really sorry. It's totally fine. But I still owe you a new trophy. Let's play for it. Not to spoil the moment, but Typhon blew up their own mine. Why? I don't know yet. But we have all the evidence we need to nail them for Gabe's death. I got a hold of Pike. He'll be here soon. Once he sees what's on that stick, it's over for Typhon. Hence the celebration. <laughs> I think we've all earned the right to enjoy ourselves a little tonight. The band's coming on soon. You'd better be front and center. Oh, rad. Do you need help setting up for the show? Nah, it's all good. We're almost there. I have to run back to the trailer. Go be a normal person for a while. Can't make any promises. Text me when it's ready. If I wanted to give away a rose, Steph and Ryan would definitely be on my list. 
Anyway, time to enjoy the festival. 232. 233. This game is so demoralizing. 234. Why do I do this to myself? No. Hmm. The Maybe red I one can was 234. Somehow. This is impossible, right? Another year, another prize gift card for yours truly to keep. I'm such a little devil. Really? Come on, jelly bean lady. That's not right. Hey there. Guess the exact number of jelly beans and win a prize. <laughs> Only one guess per person. The exact number? Is that how this game is supposed to work? <laughs> you can go right after this determined young man. She looks awfully smug for a jelly bean lady. Another year, another pride. <sighs> this game is so demoralizing. Why do I do this to myself? Last year, it's been yep. a hell of a month. I remember it clear but as this day. Makes it all worthwhile. Jed loves this town so much. It's inspiring. Wow. This is a beautiful model. I don't think this thing is checking IDs. Nobody tell Pike. Hi. Oh, hey, nice to see you. You're taking this jelly bean thing very seriously. Yeah, because the prize is a $100 gift card. Chrissy's been all anxious ever since she got lost. So I thought I could get her a bunch of treats, which is really embarrassing saying it out loud. Not at all, but sweet. Maybe I can help. Oh, for real? Are you good at this? How many jelly beans do you think there are? Three hundred... ish. Huh. Yeah, could be. Feels like something just changed in that lady by the jar. Maybe I should read her. Three hundred? What a nitwit. <laughs> Not even close. I was that far off? Hey, I've got another guess. Yeah? I think it's closer to 700. Yeah, 700 feels right. But we have to get it exactly. Just felt that lady's heart skip a beat. I should read her again. Hear me, they're really close to 731. Who is this girl? Hell yes! Your secret. The answer is 731. Don't ask me how. 731 jelly beans. That's. That's correct. Yes! Thanks so much for your help. You rule. <laughs> no sweat. I can't believe it. How did she know? Just a lifetime of emotional trauma. Got pretty lucky there, didn't ya? Super lucky. Best spring fest ever. And so, peace returned to the Jelly Bean Kingdom. Thanks again. Yeah, that was fun. So then. Where's God. the after party this year? I just hope Riley is doing after all right. Party? Oh no. Come on. What happened to Young Riley? Young man like yourself, you must know what the haps is. Hi, Eleanor. Good evening, dear. The decorations really turned out beautifully. It must have been a huge amount of work. It's worth it. So, we doing shots tonight or what? Of course. Body shots. Who's going first? Okay. Just kidding. <laughs> or am I?
Hey, so where's Riley? I haven't seen her around. She's not really in the festive spirit. She was supposed to leave town tonight. If it wasn't for, you know. Oh, I'm sorry. You were so helpful to me that day at the shop. If you see Riley, maybe you could help her too. Sure, I'll try my best. I better get going. Enjoy your night. You too. Station broadcast live from the park. This right? is it almost makes awesome. you feel like a tiny Coachella. Favorite time of the year, <laughs> by Super far. Tiny. That kind of enthusiasm is infectious, especially for me. Okay, so there's this young. Thank you, farm. Steph. Thanks for helping me find the fun again. Sounds like Ethan wasn't the only one inspired by the LARP today. Looks like plenty of people are still out around town. No, Mom, it's not an emergency. Typhon is not normal. I made a mistake coming here. Get out while you can, dude. What are you so We're ice cream about? geniuses. We run this shit. Like Keep flexing, ice cream lady. Grand opening tomorrow. Free soup and salad for Gotta spring Gotta pull my shit together for this days. grand opening. These people won't be so gracious Just, forever. We might. Free food goes a long way in Haven. I'll take a coupon. No coupons, my dear. Just tell me your name and I'll remember it. All right, Alex Chen. Alex Chen? Didn't we speak already tonight? Nope. Stupid, so stupid. Print some coupons, they said. It's a small town, I'll remember, I said. Oh, hubris. You know, you could try posting on my block. Whoever comments gets the deal. Well, that's a good idea. Best of luck. Gotta pull my shit together for this grand opening. These people won't be nice. May the best small town diner win. Lots of people still hanging out on Main Street tonight. The LARP was a lot of fun. Yeah, it was. God, you. I still like her so much. What do I do? Sorry, man. Forbidden love is a bitch. Damn it. I'm head over heels for this dork. What do I do? Wait, they're both into each other? Come on, people. Hey, um... It's the Spring Fest. You're both obviously into each other. Just make out already. What? <laughs> you heard me. Is it that obvious? Is what obvious? Fuck. Julia, I don't want to screw this up. What's obvious? Are we talking about the same thing? Look, if we weren't in the middle of the street, I would totally jump you right now. Uh, I... Do you want to come back to my place tonight? Maybe? Oh, oh my god. Absolutely yes. Her place. Tonight. Good luck making it till then. I am going to rock his world. You do that. Surprise for you. Good surprise. I didn't expect surprise. that him playing my favorite game would be a turn on. A but here we Get are. Out. Wait, is someone standing out past the Bridge of Flowers? Pretty late for a bus ride. Pretty sure that's Riley.
maybe Riley could do some company right now. Hey, Riley. Oh. Hey. What are you doing here? Just wanted to say hi. I couldn't find you at the party. Yeah. <sighs> Partying's not really in the cards. I was supposed to leave on the bus tonight. I know. So many hopes and dreams all poured into one fucking bus ride. But it's okay. Nana needs me now. She was there for me before and now it's my turn. And I don't have to do it solo. I have Mac helping me. That's something. Eleanor is so lucky to have you. Thanks, Alex. Hang in there, okay? I will. You're awesome for coming out here. I hope she can bounce back soon. Nana, no, hey, don't put that sticker up. And why not? Aren't I allowed to be proud of... Anna, I'm not going, remember? I'm staying here, with you. Right. Yes, of course. I... Riley. I'm sorry. Nothing to be sorry about. We'll scrape it off tomorrow. Steph did a really great job. Guess the festivals just dropped a block. Shit, that didn't take long. The rose can wait for now, but I should give it away before the music starts. is for you. Are you serious? Of course I am. Dude, thank you so much. This totally makes my night. I'm glad. Hey, could we meet up after the show tonight? I actually have some pretty big news to share. She said mysteriously. <laughs> of course. Speaking of, Ryan should be done any minute. Meet me there? Sure.
Holy fuck. She gave me a rose. Time to step it up, Gingrich. Hope I'm ready for whatever I've started. Can you hear me? I said, you know what? Never mind. for makeup two-faced bitch hey oh hey just in time so who's playing yours truly seriously that's awesome well wait who else I hate you both. We didn't want you to wuss out. Who said anything about wussing out? Nobody, but only because we didn't give you the opportunity. This is gonna be awesome, trust me. Um, we've never played together before, and, uh, anyway, sorry if this sucks. <sighs> Fuck it. Hey, Charlotte. How deep do you think? The lake, I mean. I don't know. I felt 
horrible this afternoon. I didn't know if I could survive that feeling. But now, it's like when your leg falls asleep. And even though it's still attached, it's become something other than you. My whole life, I've always felt so deeply. But maybe this is better? There's no shame in needing to feel numb for however long it lasts, if it gets you through another day. I don't feel ashamed. But I take your point. Thank you. At least I can survive numbness. Good to see you, Alex. Have fun at the festival. Sounds like Steph wants to meet me on the rooftop. tonight. Man, Ducky, what you doing here? Oh, you're sad. It's not the same without you, Tabitha. Never was, never will be. Tabitha, sounds like Ducky's got a story to tell. Hey, Ducky, who's Tabitha? Do you want to talk about her? You know, Alex, on this particular matter, I don't have much to say. Okay. There's got to be more I can do for Ducky. Okay. Tell me what I need to know to help him. You know, I carved that myself. Oh, hi. I'm Reginald McAllister III. My friends call me Ducky. <laughs> Tabitha Baker. Call me Tabs. bottom. What? What are you? Uh, oh, Ducky, it's beautiful. Tabitha Baker, will you marry me? Happy anniversary, love. Here's to another 30 years. And another 30 festivals, if we can make it. Ducky, you're gonna outlast this whole damn town. I know that song. Poor Ducky. 
Maybe there's something I can do. It's a tough night for you, isn't it? The Spring Fest? That's right. Give me one sec. Playing your song. Let's dance. Keep in mind why your hands like twice the size of mine. Yeah, not like that. That's pretty cool. You know what reminds me most of her right now? It's not the song or the festival. It's that you took the time to care about a sad old man for no other reason than to make the world a little less troublesome. And that was Tabs. Thank you, Alex. I think I'm a little more inclined to join the others outside. You're very welcome. Enjoy the festival. Uh, you said you have some news? I'm leaving. I'm actually leaving Haven Springs. Can you believe it? Back on the road again. Fucking finally. Wait, seriously? I'm gonna play music again, Alex. Anywhere I want. God, I forgot how fucking good it feels. <sighs> Holy shit, Steph, that's so cool. I'm really happy for you. You better keep in touch. You think it's that easy to get rid of me? Come on, Chen. I need a new destination. <sighs> You're my good luck charm. You have shit taste in good luck charms. <laughs> Shut up. Pick one. Berlin. Fuck yeah. Bowie recorded Heroes in Berlin, and that record slaps. Where am I gonna live there? Some big loft with concrete floors and exposed brick walls. I'll brood on the fire escape, writing lyrics in my leather-bound journal, and drinking absinthe straight from the bottle. Ugh. Someday? They turn the place into a museum. Steph Gingrich recorded blah, blah, blah here. And it slaps. <laughs> that sounds like a pretty spectacular plan. Great. Then come with me. To Berlin? Sure, why not? Doesn't have to be our first stop, but one day. I still have friends in Seattle who book shows. Maybe we start there, or I don't know, Kansas City. 
Vegas, wherever we want. Look, I don't want to pressure you, but I've seen you give so much of yourself to make sure other people get what they need. And I guess I wonder if you've thought about what you need. I mean, obviously, I like you a lot, Alex. You mean the fucking world to me. I mean, you guys already know what's gonna happen. Kiss me. Kiss me. Kiss me. Kiss me. don't have to decide anything now, okay? <laughs> Just think about it. I will. Thank you. I'm gonna head back down. Find me later. Hey, Gabe. Can I tell you something? I think I solved it. Why you died. Who's responsible. Isn't that crazy? I'm out of threads to pull. Which is terrifying. Because on the other side of all this, after Typhon, after you, there's just... normal life. I was kind of counting on you to show me how to do that. But I think I can figure it out. I just wish you were here to see it. Oh, um, also, I kissed Steph, so that happened.